ಗಣಪತಿ ಪರಿಪೂರ್ಣ ವಾಳ್ವರುಣ್ವಾಯೇ ಪ್ರಭು ಗಣಪತಿ ಪರಿಪೂರ್ಣ Good evening everyone. We welcome each and every one of you to our daughter Kasturi's dance arangetram. This is going to be a, a three hour solo performance with a live orchestra. Kasturi has been learning Bharatanatyam for more than 12 years from Srimati Vidya Babu and has come this far to showcase her talent. She has put in tremendous effort throughout the past six months for this day. She goes into practice with her guru for more than three hours, multiple times a week. And on other days, she spends hours and hours mastering her pieces. We are happy that you are able to come and support Kasturi's Arangetram. Once again, we welcome you all to enjoy Kasturi's dance performance. Now, I'll give it to Shreya. Thank you. Good afternoon, everyone. My name is Shreya Rajesh, and I welcome you to Kasturi's Anikitra. A few reminders, food and beverages are not allowed in this auditorium. Please do not open the auditorium doors to enter or exit in the middle of a dance piece, with the exception of small children that need a break. Please remember to turn off cell phones or put them on silent mode when entering the auditorium. Finally, remember to refrain from flash photography or videography. Thank you for your cooperation. And now I will give a brief introduction on the dance form Bharatanatyam. Bharatanatyam is an Indian classical dance form that originated in Tamil Nadu. This form of dance, presumably the oldest, is regarded as mother of many other Indian classical dance forms. 
the name of the dance form was derived by joining two words, Bharata and Natyam, where Natyam in Sanskrit means dance, and Bharata is comprised of Ba, Ra, and Ta, which respectively mean Bhavam, which is emotion and feelings, Ragam, which is melody, and Thalam, which is rhythm. Thus, traditionally, the word refers to a dance form where bhavam, ragam, and thalam are expressed. Bharatanatyam expresses South Indian religious themes and spiritual ideas. These illustrative themes and ideas are emoted through a dancer's excellent footwork and impressive gestures. The repertoire of this performance art is categorized into two main forms. The first being nirta, which is pure dance, emphasizes speed, form, rhythm, and finesse of footwork and hand movements. The second is Abhinaya, which is elaborate expressions that communicate a story. This solo debut is a significant milestone in the journey of a dancer, which marks the completion of a formal training required for the dancer to ascend the stage. Kasturi began learning dance from Srimati Vidya Babu since she was seven. Today's performance is the culmination of her hard work, dedication, and training over the past years. We are grateful for the family and friends who have graced us on this occasion to support and bless Kasturi, and we are delighted to present her Arangetram. Now, I invite Srimati Vidya Babu to say a few words. Shri Guru Bhyo Namaha. I dedicate this evening to the memory of my Guru, late Kale Mamani Shri Chidambaram Kunjidapadam Pillai. I'm here today with his blessings, the blessings of my parents, and the support of my husband. Namaskaram, and a warm welcome to all of you. We're here today on the momentous occasion of Kasturi's Arangetram. Kasuri and I embarked on this journey more than a decade ago, and it has uh, led us to this day. We have put our heart and soul into preparing toward this event, and you will see a reflection of that in tonight's repertoire. Kasuri is a remarkable student, and we have an exciting repertoire planned for you before we proceed to the main program, I'd like to take a moment to introduce the musicians here with me. They will be formally introduced later on, but I'd like to tell you about their roles in tonight's performance. To my left here is Niveta Chandrasekhar, our vocalist for tonight. So she will be playing the role of adhering to the predetermined patterns of every song in the repertoire. And she will also need to pay close attention to the cues from the dancer and me and adjust her rendering to fit the mood of the dancer and her portrayals. So that's what Niveta will be doing today. Welcome, Niveta. To the far left here is Karthik Ayer, who is our violinist for tonight. And Karthik's role is also multifold. He will be supporting the vocalist and he will also be rendering melodic variations to suit the mood of each song and the depictions by the dancer. Welcome, Karthik. And to my right here is Subramanyam Krishnamurthy on the Mridangam. I fondly call him Brother Subhu. And his role will be to, it's going to be an involved one. It's going to be to observe the dancer from head to toe, pay close attention to every movement of the dancer, 
and render his instrument to emphasize every movement she makes. He will also pay close attention to the rhythmic cues from me, melodic cues from the vocalist and the cues from the dancer. That is Subhu's role today. Welcome Subhu to our program. And as you all know, I am Vidya Babu, Kasturi's guru, and my role today will be that of a director or conductor. I will ensure harmony between the dancer's performance and the musicians. And by, I will ensure it by giving cues to the melody side and the rhythmic side as well. And I will be maintaining the rhythm using my kinnara, which is a special set of symbols that we use for dance. My musicians and I seek your well wishes tonight so that we may support Kasturi adequately in her performance. Thank you. Kasuri will start off with a Sabha Vandanam, which is an initial offering or an initial salutation to Bhuma Devi, Mother Earth, God, her Guru, the musicians, and the audience. Sabha Vandanam now by Kasturi. is Pradenya Sudhakar, and I will be co emceeing along with Rahini tonight. At the start of any activity, we invoke Ganapati, the one who governs all motion through space and time. In today's performance, we will begin with Ganapati Talam, composed by Sri T.H. Vinayakram. This musical and rhythmic piece is set to Raham Mohanam and Talam Adi. Ganapati Talam is a beautiful hymn in praise of Lord Ganesha. In this piece, the many features of Ganapati, his large elephant face, lotus-like body, and white tusks are depicted by Kasturi. Lord Ganesha, the remover of obstacles and bestower of success, is one of the widely worshipped deities. And so, we start the evening with a Ganapati song in hopes of a triumphant night. 
Vidya Aunty will now say a few words. The specialty of this song is its beautiful synergy of the rhythmic patterns, the soul cutters, and the melody. It is interwoven beautifully and makes up for an excellent dance piece. I've also introduced a couple of jathis in it to further embellish it. Ganapati Thalam by Kasturi. विकतो कट सुंदर धन्दी मुखम सुंदर धन्ती मुखम भुजगेंद्र सुसर्प गधाम रणम गजनील गजेंद्र गणाधिपतिम प्रणतोस की विनायक हस्ती मुखम तत्तीन तारीकड़ तगड़ा तत्तीन 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 तगड़ा तगड़ी तारीकड़ तगड़ा Good. 
is a gem composed by the great Subramanya Bharati. It is set in Ragam Ragamalika and Talam Kandayekam. For one, we all love stories about the mischievous and quite irresistible Lord Krishna's Lile, don't we? This sprightly piece is filled with expressive lyrics that illustrate these stories. From knocking fruits out of the gopikas' hands to pulling on their braids and raining dust on their new saris, Krishna is an ever playful boy who rains endless trouble on the women in the streets. Popular as a light piece, this song happily bridges the gap between the classical and the popular. We hope you enjoy this piece. Vidyanti will now say a few words. There are two main aspects of dance that you will need to be familiar with that will be useful in viewing this 
song. One is a sanchari. A sanchari literally means a wandering or a straying away. And in the context of dance, a sanchari is straying away from the literal meaning, quartering the literal meaning of every line and instead depicting stories, scenes or episodes that convey the meaning of the lines. And you will see a lot of sancharis in Tiradevalayata Pillai. And another element about this song is Vachika Abhinaya that I have introduced into it. So Abhinaya, as most of you will know, is uh, aesthetic expression. And there are four types of Abhinaya. Most of the time you see two types portrayed on stage. One is the um, Angika Abhinaya, which is expressing the meaning through bodily gestures. And then the Sattvika Abhinaya, which is expressing meaning through the face or emotions. You will sometimes see Aharya Abhinaya. Aharya Abhinaya is conveying the meaning or significance by way of costumes. A child can be dressed up as Krishna with a crown and a feather and uh, she can be dressed up as an evil character by wearing black. So such are Aharya Abhinaya. You might sometimes see it on stage. And then comes the Vachika Abhinaya, the fourth type. Vachika means speech. This is conveying meaning through speech. Most of the times we don't see the dancers speaking on stage. So tonight I've introduced some dialogues in the form of interactions between Krishna and the Gopika. Of course, I will be Kasturi's voice and uh, she will be lip syncing to it. And it is indeed Vachika Bhinaya nevertheless. Um, so Tira de Valiatipile is um, set up in the form of a Gopika recounting her first-hand experiences with Krishna and his pranks. I invite my, one of my senior students, Sahana Shankaran, on stage to perform a demonstration. Sahana. Yeah, that's good. Okay, take a bow, Sahana. And her younger sister, Sandhya Shankaran. Sandhya. Okay. So I will be the voice of the Gopika while Sahana and Sandhya will depict the scenes. Sahana will play the role of Krishna and Sandhya will play the role of the Gopika. Tirada Vilayattu Pillai. The endlessly playful child. He spells trouble for the girls in the streets of Gogol. First, he brings me a delicious fruit and when I've barely had a taste of it, he snatches it from my hand and when I beg him for it, he bites into it and hands me the half-eaten fruit. Oh, the playful child. He then brings me a beautiful flower and taunts me with it, reducing me to tears. He then promises to keep the flower on my hair if only I would close my eyes. And when I do close my eyes, he keeps the flower on my friend's hair instead. Oh, the playful child. He then tugs on my hair and before I can turn back, he disappears. He then throws dirt onto my colorful new clothes. Oh, the ceaselessly playful child. 
He then brings his flute and plays honey sweet music. When me and my friends are intoxicated by this melody, with our eyes closed and mouths agape, he puts live ants inside our mouths. Oh, the ceaselessly playful child. Thank you, girls. <laughs> Kasturi will play the role of Krishna and the Gopika in this song. And I can say that it's definitely the favorite of everyone on the prizes here with me. Um, yeah, they're always chanting the dialogues together and they've made it such a mirth-filled time with this whole song and Kasturi loves it too. So that's Subhu and all of us. So I hope it ends up to be your favorite as well. Thirada Vilayattu Pille. Yet, you'll put it in the 
Namaste, everyone. My name is Minu Pasupati. For those of you who don't know me, I am Kasturi's music teacher. Very honored to be here. Um, I couldn't control myself, but to speak of this. Namaskaram, Minu. Welcome. <laughs> Welcome. Thank you. I couldn't control myself, but to definitely appreciate um, about Kasturi, Stira Devalaya Tipillai, and Vidya Babu, Stira Devalaya Tipillai, of course. <laughs> so, um, I'm an ardent fan of Mahakavi Subramanya Bharatiyar, and many of you here too, including Rajesh Sundarajan, right? Um, I was at awe when Vidya was explaining about, I thought Abhinaya was expression, of course, everyone knows that, and I never knew there were different types of Abhinaya, and she was mentioning about Angika Abhinaya, Satika Abhinaya, Aharya Abhinaya, Vachika Abhinaya. I was like, wow, that's Vidya, you know? Thanks, Vidya, I learned something. <laughs> Every time I learn a lot of things from Vidya Zarangetram. So it was very interesting. And this Tira Dvalayata Pilla is a very, very popular composition of Mahakavi Subramanya Bharatiya. And uh, I would say it's Krishna Leela for dummies, right? Um, because nobody else can portray Krishna Leela in such a wonderful, simplified language, right? Beautiful words and like anybody could understand. And every little paragraph um, that was depicted here, uh, expressed here by Kasturi, was very well done, very well portrayed. And um, usually, Tira Devalayata Pillai song starts with Sindhu Bhairavi Ragam, right? I was wondering why Niveta started in Mond. Because Tira Devalayata Pillai is about the mischievous Lord Krishna, Vand. Siriyana Vand, right? Chinna Vand, Val, right? That is why she started in Mond. Is that right? <laughs> Right? They started in Mond and ended in Mond, which was really, really apt for this. And I truly enjoyed that. In the first paragraph, um, you know, it started with Sindhu Bhairavi. Tinna param kundu taruan, right? Opportunities, right? God gives us many opportunities. And, uh, and before, uh, sorry, it's not about the opportunities. Tinna param kundu taruan is the prasadam offering, right? God gives us everything in this materialistic world. And then it is fair for us to offer it to Lord and then take it. That's the significance of this paragraph. Tinna param kundu taruvan padi tinginra podile tatti paripan. Yenappan ennayan enral adanai etchil padithi kadith kudupan. We don't get the etchil padithin the food from anybody else, right? Unless they are very close to us. So God is definitely very close to us if we offer and take the prasadam. That's the significance of this paragraph. And the next paragraph is malar kundu vandu, right? That's the opportunities. God gives us many opportunities. But sometimes we feel like we almost got it, but it just goes away to somebody else. But we shouldn't get mad at it because everything happens for a reason and God knows why. So it's always better to take everything as it comes. So Kasturi very beautifully depicted all those things and I was really thrilled to see all those things. And Kallal Mayangu Vadu Pole, right? Same way, Kasturi in Dansal Namala Mayanginoma. Right? Yes. If yes, please. Thank you. Thank you so much. And it was very beautifully <coughs> sung by our Niveta and very well accompanied by Subhu and Kartikaya. Thank you so much. And I take real pride in talking about this. I'll come back soon for another song. Thank you, Meenu. A wonderful philosophical twist on the meaning of Thiraida Vilayatu Pillai. Lovely. I absolutely love that interpretation. Yeah, typical of you to think of something like that. Wonderful. At this time, we would like to now introduce the orchestra for today's event. Hailing from Chicago, student of Kalei Mamani, Sri P. Unni Krishnan, Nada Bhushanam, Niveta Chandrasekhar is a young, exemplary Carnatic vocalist. Born into a family of music connoisseurs, Niveta's musical talents were identified at a very tender age of three by her parents when they were in Singapore. The family moved to the U.S. when Niveta was five, where she continued her training. As the family hosts many artists in their house, Niveta had the privilege of interacting and learning from several stalwarts. 
She was encouraged to perform in Chennai Carnatic December Music Festival by noted flute Vidwan Padmashri Sangeetha Kal Kalanidhi, late Sri, Sri N. Ramani. Since then, Niveda has been performing in various sabhas in in India, USA, and abroad. Her recent accolade is the Dr. V. Subramanian Talent Promotion Council. Shanmukand Shabha, Mumbai. Advanced training under Kalemamani Shri P. Unnikrishnan immensely helped Niveta to internalize the aesthetics in music. This also helped her become a popularly sought out vocalist for dance anagatrams and programs. Niveta strongly believes that music has a healing power. She has performed for organizations that support and help students with disabilities and elderly care centers, including Chennai's Yekadaksha Learning Center and London Mitra Seva. She's well versed in Tirupugal and Abhirami Andati, actively leading bhajans. Adding to her merit, Niveta is a trained jazz vocalist and has performed with world music ensembles around the Chicago area. She is also undergoing Sampradaya bhajan training under Vidwan Kumbakona Narasimha Bhagavata. Along with music, Niveta is a part of a Chicago Academy of Indian Fine Arts, a nonprofit organization which is engaged in theater, music, and other fine arts. She is a published short story writer and an avid blogger. Niveta is an Indian Illinois Institute of Technology alumna, holding degrees in computer science and humanities. She currently enjoys teaching music for students across the globe, along with her busy work schedule at Northwestern Medicine. Shri Subramanian Krishnamurti, based in Chicago, has been providing Mridangam accompaniments from a very young age. He had his initial training with Shri Kuttalam Vishwanada Ayer and is currently under the advanced tutelage of Mridangam Maestro Sangeeta Kalanidhi Kalaimamani Shri Tiruvarur Bhaktavatsalam. He was a graded artist with All India Radio before moving to the US. He has been fortunate to accompany several leading senior and upcoming musicians, both in the US and in India. He continues his passion for music by both teaching and performing in US across multiple musical genres, which include Carnatic concerts, Jugalbandi, Nam Sankirtanam, classical dance, and symphony concerts. During his initial years in India, apart from performing in concerts, he has won several music competitions, including being placed first in the junior and senior categories for consecutive years from the prestigious Mailapur Fine Arts Club in Chennai, India in the early 90s. Karthik Ayer is a disciple of the renowned violinist Srimati Lalguri Vijayalakshmi. He began his violin lessons with Srimati Lalguri Vijayalakshmi and has been under her tutelage for the past 16 years. Karthik is a young but mature practitioner of his school, having imbibed the Lalguri Bani of the legendary Sri Lalguri Jayaram with all of its nuances. Lalguri Vijayalakshmi has carefully provided optimal learning techniques and developed him to achieve this level of mastery and proficiency both in layam and melody. Karthik continues to inspire many young artists. Karthik is also proficient in vocal. He had his initial training in vocal under Srimati Vasanthi Ayer of Chicago. His keen sense of laya and ragam bhavam makes him a sought after accompanist for music concerts as well as dance productions. Currently, Karthik is a sophomore at the University of Illinois at Urbana-Champaign, majoring in physics. Karthik also trains in Western violin techniques since high school and has been part of the prestigious Chicago Youth Symphony Orchestra. 
I now invite a couple of former students of Vidyanti to say a few words. Let's applaud for Karthik Ayer. Hi, my name is Sahana, and I'll be saying a few words about Vidyanti. Srimati Vidya Babu, the artistic director of the Padanjali Foundation, received her training in the Kartu Manar Koyal style of Bharat Natyam under the tutelage of Guru Kalai Mamani Sri Kunjila Padam Pillai. This style of Bharat Natyam is known for its creativity, complex footwork, and the linear geometry of the Aduvus and detailed Abhinaya. Vidyanti is also trained in Carnatic vocal music and has a master's degree in English literature. Auntie was just 19 years of age when she conducted the Arangetram of her first student in India. As a dancer and dance teacher for over 30 years now, Vidyanti has dedicated herself to advancing this art. Her strengths are her high energy, innovative teaching techniques, creative choreography, and unique jati compositions, as well as articulate rendering of rhythmic jatis and natavangam. Vidyanti is also a published poet and winner of the Palatine Poetry Contest in 2020 and 2022. Her verse writing is not limited to just English poetry and is carried forward to her jatis or rhythmic syllable patterns and creative wordplay in the forms of preludes and interludes in several compositions. Tonight, we have already seen an outstanding display of Vidyanti's capacity for composing verses in the form of dialogues in Thirate Vilayate Pile, and her artistry in rendering them and making a connection with the audience through her insights and commentaries throughout the program. Another unique feature about Vidyanti is the way she customizes a repertoire to suit the personality and potential of the individual student, highlighting their strengths and making them shine on their special day. I now invite a couple former students of Vidyanti to say a few words. Good evening. My name is Manisha Muthu, and I completed my r and from last summer under Vidyanti. As past students, we know how amazing of a teacher Vidyanti is and wanted to say a few words about her because this program would not be possible without her. As we all saw today, Kasturi dances with such beauty, grace, and passion, and her dancing really just whisks you into her world and makes you feel as though you're right there with her. She has an unbelievable natural talent for the arts, but she would be nowhere near the dancer and the person she is today without Vidyanti. Auntie has a special talent to bring out the very best in every student. She's not only an expert in the field of dance, but also teaches in a way that cultivates a love for the art form. Kids are excited to attend every class, not only to dance, but to tell her about their most recent personal endeavors and hear her feedback and stories. A fun and loving environment is crucial for the growth of any student, and Auntie is very aware of that. That's not to say that she won't push us to our very limits and point out every little mistake, but this is all to make sure we're at a level we're all proud of. During our own r and training sessions, she pays special attention to our individual characteristics, choreographing our pieces in a way that will draw attention to our strengths and minimize our weaknesses. Vivianti is dedicated to her students' success, and this is apparent when we see Kasturi's amazing performance today. Vivianti is truly one in a million, and we wish her the best of luck as, as she inspires the next generation of Bharatanatyam dancers. So sweet. Thank you, Manisha. Reverse. Good evening. My name is Divya Sivaraja, and I did my Arangetram under Vidyanti in 2019. As you'll see in Kasturi's Arangetram today, Vidyanti loves adding complex jatis, which are rhythmic interludes highlighting the dancer's footwork in her choreography. Vidyanti's dexterity with Turkinnadam, or symbols, complements the dancer, allowing them to nail the beat each and every time. 
My favorite part about learning from Vidyanti was learning these jatis. Vidyanti's teaching style adapted to how I was able to pick up her choreography. And as a result, I was able to pick up that choreography even more easily. On a more personal note, I've been learning from Vidyanti since I was four. I started off just wanting to learn dance to wear the beautiful costumes and jewelry. She cultivated my appreciation for Bharatanatyam as a classical art form and strengthened my ties to my heritage. I've also been fortunate enough to meet so many friends from dance. I also can't forget about Fuji, Vidyanti's four-legged friend. <laughs> thank you for mentioning him. Yeah, I always forget to thank him. Not that he'll know, but... <laughs> Um, just one quick story about Fuji too. Whenever I would portray a sad story or emotion, he would think I was actually sad and would want to come and comfort me. Um, it's moments like these that I'll always remember about dance. Um, thank you, Vidyanti, for cultivating this experience for me, and best of luck to Kasturi. Thank, oh, you. thank you. Thank you, sweetie. Namaskaram, everyone. My name is Aparna, and I've learned Bharatanatyam under the guidance of Vidyanti for around 10 years now, and I also completed Maya Rangesham last summer. Vidyanti spreads her love for the art form through her teaching and leads class in such a way that inspires a passion for Bharatanatyam in her students from a young age. She sees the potential in all her students and works very hard to bring out this potential in class, and especially during the preparation for a student's Harangesham. Vidyanti showcases her talent through her intricate choreographies that always push creative boundaries. I appreciate the amount of realism and attention to detail in Sancharis and the bright and energetic jatis that match the bottom of every composition. She always makes sure to pay close attention to the student's strengths and will leave no stone unturned in making sure that every move is perfect, ironing out every detail of a piece with both the dancer and the musicians. We've already seen what Kasturi and Vidyanti have come up with, and I can't wait to see that magic continue tonight. Vidyanti is, of course, much more than a teacher or a choreographer. She's our mentor, role model, dance mom, and also a friend. This relationship that's culminated with Vidyanti and all her students help us build up as people as well. One thing I'll never forget is the three Ps of dance. Posture, posture, and posture. <laughs> Posture makes a world of difference in creating a confident dancer. I remember I started as a shy and meek kid with Vidyanti and came out the other side of the Arangetram process as a confident dancer. It just goes to show that dance with Vidyanti is much more than just learning an art form. It's about learning discipline, confidence, grace, and having passion. And I'm sure all her students will agree, but I'm proud to say that I'm a better dancer and a person because of Vidyanti's guidance and tutelage the past 10 years. So thank you, Auntie, and thank, thank you. you all. And thank good you. luck to Kasturi for the rest of your performance. Hello, everyone. My name is Deepa Anandan, and I completed my arrangation with Vidya Anti in June of 2019. As a guru, Vidya Anti juggles many, many roles in the, in the lives of her students, her first role being an educator. It is beautiful and inspiring to see what Vidya Antis can do for bringing out the best potential for her students. Her passion for dance is evident in every single class that she teaches, and it spreads like fire to her students. Not only does she teach Bharatanatyam, but she also teaches us every story behind every single dance we learn, the importance of stretching and eating right before and after class, and the list goes on. As her students, it is impossible not to feel the love and care she has for us and the art form. The second role Vidyanti plays is the role of an artist. What makes Auntie's style as a guru unique is her beautiful choreography. Auntie's ability to cater her choreography to shine a light on her students' strengths and hide their weaknesses is a tribute to her talent as well as the strong relationship that she holds with each and every one of her students. As you can see today in today's performance so far, and we'll see throughout tonight, the choreography that Vidyanti has created fits Gasturi to an absolute T and truly makes her shine like the light that she already is. And the third role Vidyanti plays cannot be described in one word. Through the Anangetram preparation process, Vidyanti manages to become our best friend, life coach, motivator, and mother. 
The privilege of being Vedanti student does not only impact us on the dance floor. The lessons we have learned we carry throughout our entire life, such as passion, perseverance, and the drive to be the best and strongest version of ourselves. It is stunning to see what Kasuri and Vedanti have created to showcase to us today. Vedanti's talent, talent is very evident in the outstanding performance that Kasuri has shown us thus far, and I'm so excited to see what else they have in store for us for the rest of the evening. Thank you. Thank you, Karna. Thank you, Deepa. So there's just four of you, huh? Mm. <laughs> one of them was going to speak. Sweet. Next up, we have the Varnam. Varnam is the central and most elaborate piece in an Arangetan. It brings out the excellence and skill of a Bharatanatyam dancer and, is typically, and it typically alternates between pure dance and Abhinaya. A Varnam also gives a range of opportunities to the dancer to express their expertise in dance through various footwork, rhythms, and facial expressions. This piece is a visual delight as it provides vibrance and richness to the dance form. Punnagai Aragil Mayangi Virindain is a Varnam on Lord Muruga with an interesting tailpiece after Charanam Swaras that lead back to the Pallavi. This creation was composed by Sri Ravikiran in the, in the Karnatic Indian Ragam, Surutti, and Talamadi. Vidyanti will now say a few words. I invite Sahana Shankaran and her sister Sandhya Shankaran on stage to perform a demonstration for the Varnam. In the first paragraph, or Pallavi, of the Varnam, everyone is mesmerized by the beauty of Lord Muruga's smile. The dancer will portray Muruga as an infant. Where Goddess Shakti beholds her infant, child Muruga smile and is mesmerized by it. Muruga is then portrayed as a young child with his beautiful smile, where the beholders are endeared to him. And then, Lord Muruga as a young lad with his hypnotic smile that breaks the hearts of all the young maidens. Lord Muruga is also described as the Lord with 12 arms and the one who inspires the poetic language of Tamil. In the second paragraph, or Anupalavi of the Vadnam, the heroine refuses food she forgoes her sleep and immerses herself in devotion to Lord Muruga. She seeks refuge in her Lord and asks him to accept her. In the Charanam, or final paragraph of the song, the heroine describes how there is no one who can compare with the glory of Lord Muruga. He's the Lord who preached the meaning of Om to his father, Lord Shiva. He's the one who slayed Padmasura. He's the Lord who married Devayani, the same Lord who married the beautiful Valli. A brief depiction of Lord Muruga's marriage with Valli is portrayed. Lord Muruga disguises himself as an old man and asks for Vali's hand in marriage. Vali refuses the old man. To this, Lord Muruga, in the guise of an old man, prays to his brother, Lord Ganesha, who then appears in a giant elephant form and intimidates Vali 
into agreeing to marry the old man. The old man then comes back to his original form as the handsome Lord Muruga and marries Vali. Thank you, Sahana. Thank you, Sandhya and Sahana. Well done. I gave this material to the girls just not even a week ago. I just did some impromptu video and some impromptu audio recording and I said, go transcribe it, do something, get it done. And they did it. Good job. Just a few moments before the dancer is ready. Rigita tum ta de ra ta ri ra ta na ra ja nu ra di mi ta kundar rigita ta mutai ta ra ti ti ru na gay ati kire sa. Charavan, Aragon, Aragon, Paramogan, Mutik Kuru with the Kuru Baran, Yena Vo the Kumaran, Kumaran, Kuru Baran, Ta, De Rata, De Rata, Nada, Jerno, Ta, De Me, Takunda Riketa, Ta, De Rata, De Rata, Nada. Jerno Dazi me Takunda Rikita Mukat Paramak Churu Dia Murpata the Tark Pitti Rubar Varadan Varadan Vailavan Mupati Mubak Tamaru Adi Pain Shilan Shilan Shan Muganda 
Yeah.
Wasn't that wonderful? Yes, it sure was. I'm back again to talk about the Varnam. Punnagai Aragil Mayangi Virundin. Kandipa Nama Ellarumi in the Punnagai Aragila Kandipa Mayangi Ram Pono. I should definitely applaud uh, Kasturi for that. She kept her smile throughout the Varnam. It was close to 40 minutes. It's not a joke. You know, you and I can just sit there and, you know, applaud and talk and appreciate and do everything. And we can't dance here for even 30 seconds. You know, I'm serious because I was trying to dance for 30 seconds at my nephew's wedding. Oh my goodness, that was quite challenging for me. 30 seconds. Now she danced close to 40 minutes. So that truly deserves a big round of applause. Great job, Kasturi. What a wonderful Varnam. You know, this Varnam is in Raga Suruti. Suruti in Tamil, when the Suruti record in Zulwala, coiling, right? So in the Suruti, Niti Varnatla. Varnam is supposed to be the longest piece, right? So Suruti, Niti, Nita, Adi, Padi, Vasichi, Amakala Parthirkanga. So big round of applause, Kandipa Kurukano. Rumba Aragan or Varnam, Suriti Ragatlavanda, I don't think I've heard any Varnam so far. I think this would be the first one uh, by Sri Chitravina Ravikiran. Rumba mesmerizing Varnam, um, it brings out, uh, you know, and the Bhakti Rasam, Abde Kondu Arde. And uh, the way Vidya has choreographed it, it's totally different, you know, not like any other Varnam. Usually, Varnam has a lot of Jatis, right? More jatis in the first half, and then like two bigger jatis in the second half. But in the Vati Rumba, Vidya Samana jati pattern in the I was like, wait a minute. Hingi in the Mutai Tirala or the Tirupugala or the Pataka Murugan Mela Varnam, Murugan Mela Varnam, Murugan Kuganda or a devotional idea and a Tirupugada, Tirupugada, right? Tirupugada and Ale Murugana. So on the Tirupugada Vande, Avlo Araga Jatila. Intertwine Pani, I think Vidya Vala Matuna Gurukamudio, Nichima. Rumba beautiful Arna than the first Jatila. Yes, big round of applause for Vidya because it's not an easy task to do that. First of all, Anamari or thinking even the out of the box, right? I mean, it's it's quite different and unique. Murugan ke Rumba Aragana or Tirpugar, Adu fast paced Tirpugar, right? Muttaitara, the editor and the Trikala Jatila Porter, Avlo beautiful Sonanga, first Jatila, right? It was really, really mesmerizing. And then she did first sanchari la eppadi alaga kaartigai pengal la vandu kutti kutti chinna chinna aaru mugan eduthe evlo alaga adoda punnagiya paathu rasichi ella mesmerize aaranga appdin solla romba alaga kaamsha kasturi adukapra second jathi la paathinga na aaru padai veedu evlo alaga depict panna kasturi great job kasturi romba alaga and abhinayata kondu vandha aaru padai veedu la and adu beautiful a choreograph panninda vidya very good job and then the second Sanchari, um, Parvati Evla Araga dress pani tanoda koranda Muruga na so proud to be a mom of Muruga who's like, who has the best smile, right? I mean, in koranda kira pa Araga na smile, lavdi in soldratle, ella amma kume or peruma da, right? Kaakai kum tan kunji pon kunji abdi in soldra madri. Yella kume and the smile, uh, enak romba purucho or vishyam smile, right? Smile vandu, it can, that's the only curve which straightens any relationship. Don't you agree? Yeah. So, on the Madri or a smile, Adipadia Vichi, Murugan Mela, Avlo Aragan or Varnam, Inikinamanda, Rumba Araga Path, Rasichirko, Kasturi has truly done her best, I would say. And uh, 
கடைசியில் அந்த வள்ளி கல்யாணம் வாஸ் மை ஸ்பெஷல் ரைட் எனக்கு ரொம்ப 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 க்யூட்டாக பண்ணா வள்ளி கல்யாணம் வந்து யானை வந்து துரத்தி வள்ளி வந்து யூனோ ஷி இஸ் லைக் சரண்டரிங் அண்ட் டு லார்ட் முருகா ரொம்ப அழகான ஒரு டெபிக்ஷன் அது சின்ன ஒரு சஞ்சாரியில் அவ்வளோ அபிநயத்தை கொண்டு வந்து கொட்டி அந்த ஸ்டோரியை நம்ம கண் முன்னாடி கொண்டு வருதுங்கிறது வந்து இட்ஸ் நாட் அ அன் ஈஸி டாஸ்க் அகேன் ஸோ கஸ்தூரி டோட்டலி டெட் ஜஸ்டிஸ் ஃபார் தேட் அண்ட் ரொம்ப அழகாக சுப்புவோட மிருதங்கம் அக்கம்பெனிமெண்ட் வந்து அப்படியே என்ன சொல்கிறது ஒரு முத்து மாலையை கோக்கணுன்னா அந்த ஸ்ட்ரிங் பர்ஃபெக்டாக இருக்கணும் ரைட் எவ்வளோ அழகான எக்ஸ்பென்சிவ் முத்து வாங்கினா கூட அந்த ஸ்ட்ரிங் பர்ஃபெக்டாக இல்லைனா முத்து மாலை அருந்து விழுந்துடும் அது மாதிரி தான் ரிதம் எஸ்பெஷலி ஃபார் டான்ஸ் அக்கம்பெனிமெண்ட் ரைட் சுப்பு யூஆர் லைக் த ஸ்ட்ராண்ட் ஃபார் த முத்து மாலை யூ ப்ளேட் ரியலி ரியலி வெல் அண்ட் த மெலோடிக் அக்கம்பெனிமெண்ட் கார்த்திக் ஐயர் truly did a great job playing suruti ragam suruti suruti evlo alaga neetha vaascha romba alaga vaascha karthik and niveta romba alaga paadna especially i loved the last one where she did the yati pattern and the ni ni ri ri mama right that one with the octaves right from mandrastai to tarastai evlo alaga poi romba beautifula pani kadasila and shanmugan mudichathu romba beautifula panna and i know niveta personally because she used to be my student as well and i'm very proud to see her up on stage here and uh, she has become the most sought after uh, singer for the dance arangetrams and I'm, i i truly feel very proud um, like her very own mother i would definitely say niveta i'm very very proud of you romba alaga paana and uh, i know muruga is a favorite god so she did to- total justice to this varnam i would say ena niveta popular anade vandha and murugan paattu paadi da lemon temple la popular ana So Anala I truly enjoyed this varnam and I hope you all did too let's all give one more big round of applause to the wonderful artists here along with our fantabulous dancer for today star Kasturi Shivakumar thank you so much thank you Meenu I think his speech made the varnam even more special thank you <laughs> We will now take a short 15 minute intermission. Please make your way to the lobby for tea and snacks. The program will resume sharply in 15 minutes. will now introduce Kasturi's close friends Shreya and Meenakshi to say a few words about her. Mm-hmm. 
Hi everyone. Once again, my name is Shreya Rajesh and I've been Kasturi, or Kachuma's, best friend, sister, soulmate, and twin flame for as long as I can remember. Kasturi, I remember the first day that you discovered your passion for dance. We were all just little kids, you, yet you danced with such grace and elegance that mesmerized us all. Your dedication and commitment was so evident from the very beginning. You immersed yourself in the world of classical dance, embracing its intricate rhythms, rich cultural heritage, and the stories it told through every graceful movement. But aside from being an incredible dancer, there are no words to express how much influence that this girl has had on me over the past years. I told everyone that my favorite color was pink because it was Kasturi's favorite color. I would make Sodom into a donut shape because that's exactly how Kasturi ate it. And I told everyone, and I mean everyone, that I loved the actor Vijay just because that was my best friend Kasturi's favorite actor. I still remember the days when we were young and when Vijay's song comes on TV, Kachuma would excitedly run before the TV and start dancing. But now that we've grown up, Kasturi has become such a huge role model and someone that I get inspired by every single day. So much of my personality and existence today would not be the same without Kasturi and having this amazing person around me for so long. Kay, I love you so much. In addition to being my best friend, Kasturi continues to inspire me every day to be a better person, to always stay motivated and determined to reach my goals, and most importantly, never give up no matter what obstacles come my way. I am so incredibly proud of everything that you've accomplished. Your Arangechum is a testament not only to your talents, dedication, and the love that you have for this beautiful art form. Today, we celebrate not only your Arangechum, but also the wonderful person that you have become and continue to be. May your future be filled with endless opportunities, success, and continued growth. Now that my girl is about to finish her Arangechum and going off to college, I wish you the best in your life going forward. I know you've always wanted to be a Cali girl, but I'm glad you chose to go to Minnesota because it means that you're only seven hours away from me, and that's not that far. I would even drive all the way there just to come and hug you. Kasturi, my dear friend, a true artist and inspiration to us all, I offer my heartfelt congratulations towards your Arangechum. May your Arangechum be a night to remember, and may your dance continue to captivate and inspire audiences for years to come. I can't wait to see how you are gonna change the world because you're the biggest girl boss and most motivated queen that I know. You have made an everlasting impact on me and I am so, so, so proud of you. I love you forever and always, Akka. Thank you. Hi everyone, first off, I just wanted to say that was a breathtaking performance. Kasturi has set such a high bar for herself and we can all say without a single doubt that she has exceeded our expectations by tenfold. Um, my name is Meenakshi and I've known Kasturi practically my entire life. I met this girl when we were both five years old in the playground after newly being moved into our apartment complex. I went around asking every single kid on that playground, ni Thummer Pesvia, which for our non Tamil speakers means, do you speak Thummer? And for a little girl just being ambushed by a painfully outgoing chubby kid, Kasturi handled it amazingly. <laughs> by some twist of fate, we found out that we were neighbors, living right next to each other in the same building on the same floor. After that moment, we were inseparable. <laughs> to non-stop play dates, to bate and shloka classes with each other's parents, and me and Kasturi were practically joined at the hip. Now, you guys are seeing Kasturi today as a graceful, established dance student, but I remember seeing her as a dance teacher in elementary school. Our little friend group decided to put on a show for our talent show and although Priyanti was the one that choreographed the dance, I vividly remember Kasturi being the only one actually getting all of the steps correctly. The rest of us, not so much. 
So Kasturi, being the kind person she is, would it help us improve our dance moves? For the group of uncoordinated 10-year-olds she took on, she did a fantastic job. I have trouble organizing my tasks for the day. I can only imagine how hard it must have been to rally a group of children with itty bitty attention spans. If you don't believe me, I promise I have copious amounts of video proof. But all in all, I am so proud of Kasturi for what she's done and how much she has grown as an individual and a dancer all these years. Kasturi says she couldn't have done it without me, but I don't believe her. She is one of the most determined, kindest, driven women I've ever known, who once she sets her mind on something, doesn't let it go. And one of my biggest privileges has been seeing her skip away to the first day of kindergarten together, to seeing her march on to her amazing academic and professional career. I believe she helped herself through her own initiative and dedication. So thank you, Kasturi, for being my best friend. I will never forget us geeking about our books and giggling on FaceTime about Taylor Swift and The Weeknd. You have my rock, my constant, my girl, for as long as I can remember. Even though we're gonna be seven hours away from each other, I'm still gonna be your biggest fan. I'm gonna drive up to Minnesota and we're gonna see each other as much as possible. And I can't wait to see what you do next and I can't even express in words how proud I am of you. Thank you so much. The next piece, Nachiyar Thirumuri, Varanamairam, is set to Ragam, Ragamalika, and Thalam Adi. Andal, the poetess and saint of the 9th century, is the only female to be recognized as an Alvar. Alvars were the Tamil poet saints of South India who espoused bhakti to the preserver deity, Lord Vishnu. Andal was brought up by Nammarvar, another great saint, and falls deeply in love with Lord Ranganada. In this song, Andal tells her friend about her dream in which she got married to Lord Ranganada. She relays the sequences of her dream in seven stanzas. Each stanza is a reference to some of the most important rituals of a marriage ceremony. Vidyanti will now say a few words. Every song that is chosen for Kasuri in tonight's repertoire has a history behind it, and uh, this one has a shortest history. I basically chose this song for her because I envisioned seeing Kasuri in the Andar costume and the Konde. I, I just felt it looked so beautiful on her, and it would suit her sweet personality. That's the reason I chose this song. We have... Um, we have introduced, in the first part of the song for the entry, we have introduced parts of the Nachiyar Kautua to initiate the Andar song itself. I hope you enjoy it. Thank you. I'm 
மடம் தண்ணிலே சுக்கிரவாரம் அவதாரம் ஆகிய தக்கிட்ட தக்கி தருகிட்ட தக்கி கிட்ட தக்கி சங்கம் ஏந்தி ஏ திக்கிட்ட தக்கி திருகிட்ட தக்கி கிட்ட தக்கி திகிரி அணிந்தவர் தொங்கிட்ட தக்கி தொனக்கிட்ட தக்கி கிட்ட தக்கி ஜோதியானவர் நம் கிட்ட தக்கி நான் கிட்ட தக்கி கிட்ட தக்கி நாமமாயிரம் வட்ட பத்திர சையனுக்கு சூடி கொடுத்த வட்ட பத்திர சையனுக்கு சூடி கொடுத்த வட்ட பத்திர சையனுக்கு சூடி கொடுத்த பூமகளாகிய கோதை கனவிலே கோதை கனவிலே
Wow, what a graceful and expressive performance. Let's give it up for Kasturi one more time. <laughs> Next, I would like to introduce Kasturi's grandparents to say a few words about her. Manulakatinil Piravi Masare. Yenia Purulam, Yelidil Muture, Kanudal Vudayador, Kalitri Mamuhe, Panavan Malaredi, Panin the Potuam. Well, Larko Manakam Kasturi or a party, Nakasturi Murgis and Pesra Kasturi Paranda de Lerde, Avanju Vaisu Varakum, India La Irkra Varakum. America <laughs> அப்படி <laughs> Ade Madri, Christian part of the body. Christian Ave, Radeavo, Ilama, Vlavinikra. Seri Adan Vinacha, Barnathale, Murhanade, are but a beating in Gondonde, Namakandamanale in Irti. And that Sulave Venda. Alanara and Anavo, Avlenikra. And that Avo, Avlenikra. The La Pak Bode, Paratan Kvartia, Ille. In the Mane, Aladi, Unmele and a key. Sinna kalan dale, nada nada ramba asa. Yaitu pelanggan la orang tiada nama orang turun kumpul deh. Itu kalau asa pada lama, nada kalah. Adik kahwe, yang ponnya nangga pak, nanti yang pergi ke baca. Abadu yang dua belas tahun pergi cah. Anakalo, orang ini tanah datar itu guna na wipe kerja kalah. Yang kanan mereka anggaran deh transfer anak deh nala. Yang ada marah dalam kahwe ni tuan tuh. Anak orang ini tuh pak kembali ni leh ni warta pate. Adik yang peti. Anda orang itu orang yang terus leh na India leh orang tu bandi, pat senosha pada wacita. Aba orang yang terus bila nalla marilah nak kerja na, modal karena, bidya babung kira, anda guru kerja cede abal kor barang. Rendah ni, abal kerumba ansur niya, ada raba, amma, appa, tangge, moon beri orang de, abal ibla nalamik kondo under ke support panir kan, ada leh abal kerumba duduk. Ini semua boleh, abah ramah kerja perlu walaih si, ada mayor si bani, bela dua orang tu kan ada na ada tu, nama kita ramah senosha. Ini semua pakai bodi, anggeru tu bandar tu, ini bela udar ke, abah ini nak kira. Ini semua ti mana, ini Amerika sulit ni lela, beranda koda, ini rende pembelah peling leh, ada ha rende kand madri walaih tu, abah ini, ini bela abah ni lemik gunting tu kan leh. Ya, makan siwa bayu, baru makan priya bayu, parati, balti berdaya beri. Ini deh madri, ini china peti orang orang kita, ini selama berusut lah nak kono, aduk kau berhenti kere, mana kau? Elarkum, elarkum mana kau? Nanu ini Tamilan tu lah, orang ni dah mandiri kan? Nanu kasturi orang Tata, anda kasturi kau, orang kau guru pergi ke utru mai. Ada tu, orang ni perangai jadi masa musim, kasturi orang ni perangai jadi masa musim, kudu sokong orang dah. Adu bolak, elar orang ni perangai jadi ke katangan na, nama perangai jadi soli ruang. 
ஆனால் நம்முடைய மகன் பேர மகனோட பிறந்த தேதியோ பே பேத்தி பேரனுடைய தே தேதியை கேட்டால் கூட கொஞ்சம் யோசித்து சொல்லணும் ஆனால் கசீருடைய பிறந்த தேதியை கேட்டால் டகார்னு சொல்லிடலாம் அது ஜனவரி இருபத்தாறு ஒன்று எங்கள் பாரத தேசத்தோட குடியரசு தினம் அதனால் அது என்றைக்குமே மறக்காது இருபத்தி ஆறு ஒன்று எங்கள் குடியரசு தினம் இந்திய பாரத தேசத்தோட குடியரசு தினம்னு வந்தாலே கஸ்தூரியோட எங்களுக்கு என்ன வரும் கஸ்தூரிய நாங்கள் வாட்ஸ்அப்பில் தான் பார்த்துக்கிடுவோம் கஸ்தூரி பிறந்த ஒரு மாதத்தில் அவங்க பேசும் ஜெக அந்த கஸ்தூரியம்மாள் பேசுகிற மாதிரி அந்த கஸ்தூரி ஒரு மாத குழந்தையாக இருக்கும்போது வீட்டில் ஒரு மெத்தையில் படுக்க வச்சுருப்பாங்க எங்கள் மகா ருக்மணி பக்கத்தில் இருப்பாள் நான் ஆஃபீஸ் முடிஞ்சு வீட்டுக்குள்ளே இரவு எட்டு எட்டரை மணிக்கெலாம் வருவேன் நான் அந்த மொதல் காலடி வைக்கவுமே அவள் கையை காலை போட்டு அப்படி ஆட்டிக்கிட்டு இருப்பாள் எங்கள் பிரியாவே சொல்லுவாள் ஆ அப்பா வந்து அச்சு ஆஃபீஸில் இருந்து அப்படிம்பாங்க என்ன அப்படி கேட்கிக்கன்னா என்ன என் பேத்தி கையை காலை ஆட்டுதாலே அப்படிம்பாங்க அந்த சின்ன குழந்தைய அப்படி தூக்கி தோலில் வச்சுக்கிட்டு அந்த பெருமாள் கோயில் அந்த நேரம் நட சாத்திருக்கோம் அந்த பெருமாள் கோயில் வர கொஞ்சம் தூரம் நடந்து திரும்ப கொண்டு வைப்பேன் அதோ அவதா இதாக இருவா அப்படி அன்னைக்கு பார்த்த ஒரு சின்ன குழந்த அன்னைக்கு தரையில் படுத்துக்கிட்டு அவங்க சொன்ன மாதிரி தரையில் கையை காலை ஆட்டிக்கிட்டு இருந்த குழந்த இன்னைக்கு இந்த ஸ்டேஜில் இப்படி நின்று ஆடுதுன்னு பார்க்கும்போது என்னே நம்ப நம்ப முடியலை சில சமயம் நம்ம கண்ணே நம்ப நம்ம நம்ப முடியாது சொல்கிற மாதிரி எங்களால் என்னே நம்ப முடியலை சொல்லுவாங்க சில சில மகிழ்ச்சி சில சந்தோஷங்கள் வாழ்க்கையில் ஒரு ஒரு தடவை கிடைக்கும் அது பிறகு எத்தனை தடவை கிடைச்சாலும் முதல்ல கிடைக்கிற சந்தோஷம் அந்த உணர் உணர்ச்சி அது மனசில் என்றைக்கும் நீங்காமல் இருக்கும் இந்த நிகழ்ச்சி என் என் ஜீவனம் உள்ள வர என்றைக்கும் அப்படி மனசில் இருக்கும் ஆனால் பேசுறதுக்கு எவ்வளோ என்னெல்லாமோ குறிப்பெல்லாம் பேசியிருக்கேன் ஆனாலும் பேச தான் முடியலை ஏன்னா அவ்வளோ இது எங்கள் இதில் நாங்கள் வந்து நானும் என் மனைவியும் சேர்ந்து என் மக ருக்குமணியை எங்கள் சக்திக்கு தகுதிக்கு ஏற்ப உயர்த்தி தான் பிடிச்சோம் ஆனால் என் என் மக ருக்குமணியும் திரு சிவாவும் அவ்வளோ உயரத்துக்கே கொண்டு போயிட்டாங்க அப்படின்னா என்ன சொல்கிறதுன்னே தெரியலங்க ஆமாம் கஸ்தூரியா பாடல் நடனம் ட்ரைவிங் ட்ரைவிங் அன்றைக்கி அவள் கார் ஓட்டி உட்காந்துட்டு போனால் எனக்கே பயம் இந்த சின்ன பிள்ளை கார் ஓட்டிகிட்டு போதே அப்படின்னு அவள் ஓட்டு தான் என் மக ருக்குமணி கார் ஓட்டி போயிருக்கேன் என் மருமகன் சிவா கூட போயிருக்கேன் என் கஸ்தூரி ஓட்டினா பாருங்கள் காரில் உட்கார்ந்த ஒரு உணர்வே தெரியலை அவ்வளோ அற்புதம் இன்றைக்கி நடனம் நாங்கள் எங்கள் ரு ருக்குமணியை நாங்கள் உயர்த்தி தான் பிடிச்சோம் ஆனால் என் மக ருக்குமணியும் சிவாவும் உச்சத்துக்கே கொண்டு போயிட்டாங்க இன்னும் எத்தனை உச்சத்தை தொட தொடர்மையும் இருக்குது அவங்களும் அவர்கள் என் பேத்தி கஸ்தூரி எல்லா வளமும் எல்லா செல்வமும் பெற்று பல்லாண்டு வாழ எல்லா இறைவனை வேண்டுகிறேன் நன்றி வணக்கம் வணக்கங்க எல்லாருக்கும் வணக்கம் நான் கஸ்தூரியோட பாட்டி ருக்மணியோட அம்மா நாங்கள் ருக்மணிய தாங்கி பிடிச்சி நல்லா படிக்க வச்சு நல்ல லெவலில் கொண்டு வந்தோம் ஆனாலும் இன்னைக்கு அந்த ருக்மணியும் சிவாவும் சேர்ந்து இந்த அளவுக்கு இந்த பொண்ணை உயர்த்தி வச்சுருக்காங்கன்னா அதுக்கு ரொம்ப பெருமைப்படுறேன் அவங்களுக்கும் ஒரு பெருமை அவளால் அவங்க அம்மா அப்பாவுக்கும் ரொம்ப பெருமை இல்லையா அதனால் ரொம்ப சந்தோஷமாக இருந்துச்சு அந்த பதஞ்சலி முனிவர் ப பண்ண இந்த பரதநாட்டிய கலை இந்த அளவுக்கு இங்கே வந்து ரொம்ப ரீச் ஆகியிருக்கு நல்லபடியாக நடத்தியிருக்காங்க அந்த பாட்டு டீச்சருக்கும் நன்றி இந்த அளவுக்கு பாட்டு டீச்சர் மட்டும் இல்லை பரதநாட்டியம் பண்ணி கொடுத்தவங்களுக்கும் நன்றி பரதம் பாட்டு நீச்சல் எல்லா விதத்திலையும் என் பேத்தி உயர்ந்து தான் இருக்கா ஒரு வகையிலையும் குறையில ரெண்டு பேத்தையுமே ரெண்டு கண்கள் மாதிரி ரெண்டு பேருமே ஒருத்திக்கு ஒருத்தி சலைச்சவலே இல்லை இருந்தாலும் இந்த அளவுக்கு உயர்த்தி கொண்டு வந்து அம்மா அப்பாவுக்கு ஒரு பெருமை தேடி பிடித்த பொண்ணு ரொம்ப சூப்பராக வாழ்க்கை ஆயக்கலைகளை அறுபத்தி மூணும் நல்லபடியாக அவள் கற்று நல்ல தெளிவடைஞ்சு வரணும் அதுதான் இவ் எங்களுடைய பிரார்த்தனை வணக்கம் Next up, Kasturi's sister Rahini will say a few words. Hello everyone, I am Kasturi's younger sister Rahini. Before I begin talking about my sister, I'd like to mention that I will be addressing her as Akka, 
which is older sister in Tamil, and my grandfather has specially requested that I talk in a little bit of Tamil, because there's been way too much English tonight. When we were young, Akka had always been my competition. Sure, she was my role model, but as any other younger sibling would, I wanted to do everything that she did. She would sing songs from movies, and so I would sing songs from movies. She started learning to sing classical Carnatic music, and I also forced my parents to send me to music class. And in these classes, the teacher would teach her how to play the keyboard while she was singing. So she had this mini keyboard that she'd learned to play, and guess what I did? I convinced my parents to get me a mini, mini keyboard so that I could do every single thing that she did along her side. And that was also what happened with dance. Akka started le learning dance when she was in second grade, and so obviously, as always, I also had to join. But at that time, I was, on I was only three or four, and they said I was too young for classes. And you should have seen the amount of tantrums I threw. But finally, they decided that I couldn't go to the classes yet. And so when she'd practice for little recitals, I would peek through the door and try out the dance moves that she was doing. Eventually, one day, I was old enough to learn dance, and it, was, and it has been very important to me as well. And somewhere along the way, she went from being my competition to my best friend. She may be my sister, but I'd consider her my twin. Not a single detail about her day or my day goes unshared. A large majority of my life was shaped by my sister. She was the guinea pig in our family. She'd tell me what to do, what not to do in school and in life. She's the main reason that I am where I am today, and I can't thank her enough for that. As Shreya said earlier about her adapting Kasturi's favorite color and favorite actor, Akka's that one person that everyone, just, that everyone just wants to follow. Her determination and drive take her to great heights, and her success is motivation for everyone else around her. If I was able to go on, I, okay, I would be able to go on and on about her. There's so many details and stories that I can share about my sister, but I'd, li I'd like to end by saying I'm so, so proud of you, Akka. Like, so, so proud. I've seen her go in for hours and hours of practice every single day for the past six months, and all of her effort is clearly evident in her beautiful performance today. I'm not only proud of this milestone in your dancing journey, but in your life as well. You've graduated and you're going off to college, and I feel like it still hasn't struck me yet because I'm gonna miss you so much. But I know you'll, but I know you'll be doing great things in your future. I love you so much. Thank you. Aye Metta Kadinam is a composition by Gopala Krishna Bharati. This beautiful song in Ragam, Punnaga Varani, and Tadamadi is about Nandanar, who was an adherent devotee of Lord Shiva. Nandanar was considered an untouchable man due to the creed he's born into. He lived as a slave who would do anything as commanded by his master. He was a sincere worker and mainly did agricultural work for his master. Nandanad had a deep yearning to see Lord Nadaraja, the dancing form of Lord Shiva, and did not pass a moment without thinking of him. He was such an adherent, ardent devotee of Lord Nadaraja that he would start singing and dancing unmindful of the time or place or the work he was engaged in. However, as an outcast, he was banned from entering any temple back then. In this piece, we will see the hardships Nandanad faces as he attempts to catch a small glance of the Lord, as well as his all-consuming devotion to Lord Shiva. I will pass it on to Vidyanti. There was a reason I chose this song for Kasturi. 
I always have a talk with the girls and their parents to ask about their family deities, their Ishta Devatas. Ishta Devata is, you know, your desired deity, a deity that's closest to you in heart. When I spoke about that, I uh, found out that, <laughs> yeah, there are two Shivas involved in this song, so I have to delineate between those two. One is Lord Shiva, the king of dance, and the other Shiva is Kasturi's father. So uh, I spoke to Shiva, and uh, he said that his father, uh, Shri Murugeshan, his uh, Ishta Devata was Lord Shiva. And it meant a lot to them. And uh, my Ishta Devata is Lord Shiva as well. He is the coolest of all gods. <laughs> um, so, and this song is particularly dear to me because when I was really young, probably when I was uh, nine or 10, I've seen my guru make one of his senior students dance to this song. I didn't much comprehend the context of it like I do now where this is the devotee who's yearning for a glimpse of Lord Shiva, but the community he's born into prevents him. So I did not much know that, but once I did, as I was getting older, I'm thinking back on those days and it absolutely touches my heart. So this song is a tribute to Kasturi's grandfather, Sri Murugesh. I'd like to take a moment to say a few thank yous while the dancer is still getting ready for the following song. Um, first, I'd like to thank Kasturi's parents, Shiva and uh, Priya, Rukmani. Uh, they are, they've been so kind and generous and thoughtful throughout the past years and through these past more trying months and I'm really grateful to know them as as human beings they are so wonderful and I'm really grateful to know their family and our friendship will go way past this Arangetram it will go on for years to come thank you Shiva and uh, Rukmani Priya and I should definitely I'm very thankful to Kasturi herself as I always say, my every student of mine teaches me something valuable and Kasturi has taught me that with determination and passion, anything is possible. When I started off classes with her toward the preparation of the Arangetrams, we had some really challenging moments, especially because this Arangetram was scheduled to be in June and uh, I barely got any opportunity with the kids without school. Um, so they had to balance, Kasturi had to balance her school, her AP exams and everything that was going on with the uh, rigorous dance practice. And how she stood up to that challenge, it absolutely melts my heart. And uh, yes, Kasturi will always hold a very special place in my heart. I call all my uh, girls who've done their Arangetram under me, my Arangetram daughters. And yes, I've gained another Arangetram daughter today. Thank you, Kasturi, for that. Big thanks to my husband, Babu, for his indispensable support. I, I, that, that's the reason I started off the program saying I'm here only with the blessings of my parents and the support of my husband. I, I would not be here without Babu. Thank you for everything you are and everything you do. I'm so blessed. I'd like to thank my musicians Niveta here, vocalist, what a fantastic chapter she did today. Her finishes brought tears to my eyes. It, it was amazing. Thank you, Niveta, for elevating Kasturi's dance today. 
And yes, there was a reason her grandparents were, you know, they had tears in their eyes too. Yes, music is a very, the vocal is a very important part of dance. Thank you so much. And she's so dedicated. In the Arangetram that happened two weeks ago, I mentioned that I kept bombarding her with my uh, voice messages, each with different corrections or, uh, you know, clarifications. This time, she exceeded me. Guruva Minjana Shishya Naita. Amma, Ava Yenaka, Uru Padanja voice messages and for Unanathu or Lainuku clarification. I mean, I love that. That is what I want. Thank you for uh, making this experience <laughs> really easy for me. I loved it. Thank you, Karna. And Karthik on the violin, what can I even say about this kid? He's 21. I like to announce that all the time. And the vice is the announce that I'm the vice is the that I'm So, amazing, Avashikana. He did such a fantastic job. And in the last minute, you know, I'm telling him, until the last minute, I keep telling him, hey, can you do this? Can you do that gimmick? You know, I'm saying, ah, aha, I'm saying, oh, yes, auntie, I'll do it. He, he's so passionate about what he does and he brings his youthful energy into our uh, musician's family. I'm so grateful to have Karthik here as our violinist today. Thank you, Karna. Yes. And Subhu, he's very rightly placed on my right hand side. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Right? I had this wrist problem. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But really, his attention to detail and how he focuses and stays with rapt attention on every movement of the dancer, and he will not miss a single gesture by her. He, he would just go all out. And every cue, I just give a small cue, he would take it to the next level. I just go like this, he'll go da 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 So, just been an amazing experience. And he, he brings that extra, his quaint sense of humor and his puns and his witticisms definitely add mirth to our already pretty mirthful um, dance uh, orchestra uh, family. And uh, he's, he's like a brother to me. He's my adopted brother of uh, Chicago. I've crowned him my adopted brother of Chicago. Thank you, Subhu. Thank you for adding so much power to Kasturi's performance tonight. I love that. Um, I, I always, you know, when I thank Niveta, I'm forgetting about uh, her uh, family members. I have to thank Niveta's um, husband, first of all, Abhi, who will always come to the rehearsals, help us out. He is a sweetheart. Thank you, Abhi. Wonderful. It's just wonderful to have him around. You know, he brings that certain ambience there of calm. Of, <laughs> yeah, it's like I can breathe with him around easy. Yeah, because we're all hyper. And um, her, Niveta's parents, they're extremely supportive. And they, she wouldn't be able to do all this without their support. And I know she has a puppy too, you know, like mine. What's his name? <laughs> wow. Burfi. <laughs> yeah. So her puppy and they take care of him. That's how she's able to come to the rehearsals. And uh, her mom accompanies her and she uh, consults with her father about the pronunciations. And, she, you know, I have to thank them, Mala and uh, Shekhar also. Thank you. And big mention to uh, Subhu's wife, Hema. The uh, omnipresent Hema, she's everywhere. Everywhere Subhu is, you will see. He, he, she is your better half. Sorry, yeah. <laughs> yeah. She does everything. Yeah, she does everything. She knows all about sound checks, and she even will direct him. If I'm the director of these musicians here, he has his own director. Yeah, and she did my sorry three pleating today. She's just amazing at everything she does. And most of all, she's got the kindest and the largest heart of any person I've met so far. Thank you, Hema, for everything you did for us and will do for us. Thank you. Uh, and of course, the audience, you've been such an appreciative crowd. And it, it has been amazing. Thank you for taking the time out of your Sunday to come here and support, applaud, and encourage us. It means the world to us, and I'm so very grateful to all of you. Thank you. Of course. Yes. 
because for the last arangetram kartik's parents were not present so i forgot about them yes they are a, they play a huge role in kartik's uh, progress in music previously they used to drive him and stay with him throughout this time you know they've trusted their son with the driving so they don't have to drive him but their support is huge and i absolutely love the way they are such great appreciators of our uh, music and so encouraging thanks big thanks to kartik's parents
மகாகவி பாரதியார் பத்தி அந்த பாட்டு தீராத விளையாட்டு பிள்ளை பத்தி பேச வந்தேன் இப்ப லாஸ்டா வந்து நான் கோபாலகிருஷ்ண பாரதியோட காம்போசிஷன் இது நந்தனார் சரித்திரம் அப்படின்னு ஒரு ஃபுல் செட் ஆஃப் காம்போசிஷன்ஸ் பண்ணியிருக்கார் கோபாலகிருஷ்ண பாரதி அவ்வளோ அழகாக அனுபவித்து எழுதியிருக்காரு நந்தனார் அவர் வந்து அறுபத்தி மூன்று நாயனார் நாயன்மார்களில் பதினெட்டாவது எயிட்டீன்த் ஆஃப் த சிக்ஸ்டி த்ரீ நாயன்மார்ஸ் இன் சைவிசம் ரைட் ஸோ சிதம்பரம் போகணும்னு அவ்வளோ ஆசையாக வருது அந்த சிதம்பரம் போகணுங்கிறதுக்காக அந்த டிசையர் ரைட் ஸோ I strongly feel that desire is the main ignition behind every achievement whatever it might be in among the you know aya kalaygal 63 appadina avanga kasuriyoda party sonna maadhiri and the endha kalaya kattukano enna sadhikano vaalkaiyala nanachalum first spark right agni kunjundru kandeen appdin sonnar bharathiyar andha mari andha kutti agni kunjungiradhu endha the desire da desire is the spark that ignites any achievement do you all agree with me so kasturiyoda in the desire passion to learn the beautiful art of bharatanatyam and the desire da ignite panni avloda passion iniki ivula iniki arangetram pandra alavukku kondu vandu uttirukku of course with the you know mercy of the lord 
Guru Kripa, and of course, the wonderful musicians out here. Let's give them a big round of applause. Even if you are not here, you will be able to achieve your achievement, right? Backbone of uh, Kasturi Sarangitram today. What a wonderful set of uh, panel of musicians, right? Vidya, you are a dancer, you are a dancer, you are a dancer, you are a dancer. அவருக்குறேட் <laughs> 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 Uh, ornaments are full of snakes. He is the coolest one. He is the coolest one. So, snake is not a snake. It is a very beautiful song. 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 பியூட்டிஃபுல்லாக ஸ்டார்ட் பண்ணான் நிவேதா ரொம்ப அழகாக இருந்தது அந்த ஸ்னேக்ஸ் அப்படியே இன்னும் ஸ்னேக் டான்ஸ் எப்போவுமே எல்லாருக்குமே ரொம்ப ஒரு அட்ராக்டிவ் டான்ஸ் ரைட் அதையும் அப்படியே ஒரு குறை இல்லாமல் அதையும் கொண்டு வந்து இங்கே இன்கார்பரேட் பண்ணிட்டாங்க எதாவது ஒரு குறை கண்டுபிடிக்கலான்னு பார்த்தா முடிய மாட்டேங்குது வித்யா அவங்க அரங்கேற்றத்தில் நானும் வந்து புடம் போட்டு பார்க்குறேன் எப்படியான கண்டுபிடிச்சிடலான்னு முடியவே மாட்டேங்கிறது இட்ஸ் குவைட் சேலஞ்சிங் யூனோ ஸோ அதை கொண்டு வந்தாங்க அழகாக அதே மாதிரி சிவனோட இன்னொரு ஆஸ்பெக்ட் பார்த்தீங்கன்னா என்னது Of course, he is a great dancer, no doubt about it. Chidamaratil, Natarajar. And the dance is not called the dance, but the dance is not called the dance, right? He is called the dance, right? And the dance is not called the dance, right? And the dance is not called the dance. You know, give, give her a big round of applause. How many dance teachers can be choreographed? If you take a dance, what the dance is called the dance, whatever the presiding deity is for that dance, right? The, and the deity is, whatever is associated with the deity bringing that into the choreography is not an easy joke trust me it's, it's very very challenging and to even think in that aspect it it requires a special expertise which is abundant in vidya babu great job vidya i'm very proud to be your uh, you know associated with you i truly enjoyed this um, nandanar charitram is usually very emotional you know any song you take from nandanar charitram it's it's full of pathos and it it kind of you know uh, touches your heart and it's it's quite emotional adha madiri da irundhadu ipo inniki dance panna inda iye metta kadinam abdingra paatu it's quite rare uh, i don't think i have seen this song anywhere in arangetrams um, with my experience of course yaar ad panirkalam theriyala but today i really enjoyed uh, kasturi depicting that evlo alaga andha oru krishna roda vaandu thanathiyum alaga kaamikira முருகனோட புன்னகை அழகையும் அழகாக காமிக்கிறா இங்கே வந்து நந்தனார் சரித்து நந்தனாரோட ஏக்கம் சிதம்பரம் நடராஜரை நான் போய் பார்க்க மாட்டேனா அப்படின்னு அவர் ஏங்குற அந்த ஏக்கத்தை அவ்வளோ அழகாக அந்த அபிநயத்தில் எக்ஸ்பிரஸ் பண்ண கஸ்தூரிக்கு ஒரு ஓ போடுங்கப்பா அது கிரேட் ஜாப் நம்ம ராஜேஷ் எங்கே எங்கே போயிட்டா எங்கே வெளில போயிட்டாரா விசில் எங்கப்பா எங்கே ஆ ஏதோ ஆ அதே எங்கோ அதை தான் எதிர்பார்த்தேன் நான் ஸோ அந்த மாதிரி அந்த பேத்தோஸ் அது அவ்வளோ அழகாக டெபிக் பண்ணால் அந்த ஏக்கம் அந்த ஏக்கத்தை கொண்டு வருது இந்த நவரசங்களில் வந்து ஏக்கம் ரொம்ப சிரிக்கிறது எல்லாரும் சிரிச்சிடலாம் அந்த ஏக்கம் கொண்டு வருது வந்து ரொம்ப கஷ்டமான ஒரு விஷயம் அது எஸ்பெஷலி ஒரு ஸ்மைலி சைல்டு கஸ்தூரி அவள் வந்து எதுவுமே வந்து சோகமாக இருந்து நான் பார்த்ததே இல்லை மியூசிக் கிளாஸ் வரும்போது ஹேங் ஆண்டின்னு சிரிச்சுட்டே வருவோம் அவ்வளோ சாஃப்ட் நேச்சர்டு அவங்க பாட்டி சொன்ன மாதிரி ஃபுல்லாக ஃபபினையாக பேசும்போது நான் நினைச்சுப்பேம்மா நீ டான்ஸ் கிளாஸ் தான்மா நீ இப்போ பாட்டு கிளாஸ் தானம்மா வந்திருக்க நான் வித்யா பாபு இல்லையே நான் மீனும் ஆண்டியில் பாட்டு கிளாஸ் தானே வந்திருக்கேன் எதுக்குமா இவ்வளோ அபிநயம் அப்படின்னா அவளுக்கு அது தானாக வருது விவேக் சொல்கிற மாதிரி அதுவா வருது அப்படிங்கிற மாதிரி அதுவா அவளுக்கு அபிநயம் தானாக வருது ஸோ அபிநயம் இஸ் லைக் ஹர் என்ன சொல் ஒரு அவளோட எக்ஸ்பர்டீஸ் அது ரைட் அண்ட் ஷி ட்ரூலி ஜஸ்டிஃபைட் தட் டுடே அண்ட் ஐம் வெரி வெரி ப்ரௌட் டு பி அ பார்ட் ஆஃப் கஸ்தூரிஸ் அரங்கேற்றம் though i was in singing there i'm very honored to even be speaking here because singing and speaking are two lovely things i enjoy doing it thank you to shiva and rukmini for giving me this opportunity to speak and share the stage with kasturi on her big day it means a lot to me and uh, thank you so much vidya subbu niveta and kartik for letting me um, say a few words about you and it's always an honor for me to talk about all of you because i've known all four of you for many many years and uh, you're always special to me 
And uh, I feel very, very happy talking about you anywhere, anytime. Thank you so much, and you all have a great evening. We still have dance. Please don't go. Uh, my speech is over, so I just wanted to thank you all. Thank you. <laughs> thank you, Meena. Unga speech, unga speech, or a piece, Marie, and the Ama, Pramada, Madul, Kalapit, or a pathos, and the item that should it or a pathos go visit a wangin at Parugo. Adaka, Ure, Unglala, the Mudio. Yes, thank you so much, and uh, we are all humbled by your words of appreciation and praise. There is so much more we have to learn, improve, and achieve. And thank you all. I'm so grateful. And Meenu, thank you so much. Tilana is the concluding piece of a Bharatanatyam repertoire. Set to Brindavani Ragam and Adi Talam, it is one of the most buoyant and energetic items in an Arangetram. This composition by Dr. M. Balamurali Krishna is a nritta or pure classical dance comprised of graceful movements with sculpturesque poses. This tilana is packed with intricate footwork, statuesque positions, and exuberant dance movements. This will be followed by Mangalam, a prayer for auspiciousness to all. Kasturi will give her final salutations and offer her gratitude to God, Guru, musicians, and the audience for their support, guidance, and, encour and encouragement. Not 
to Bhuma Devi, God, Guru, musicians and the audience. Bhava <laughs> Mahana now be presenting the graduation certificate to Kasturi. Take a sip of water and then walk on stage. Thank 
Kasturi will now felicitate Vidya Andi and the orchestra and express her thanks for their guidance and support. Kasturi would first like to present Vidyanti with a gift. Kasturi would next like to present Niveta with a gift. Kasturi would next like to present Sri Subramanian or Subu Uncle with the gift. Kasturi will next present. Shri Kartik Ayer with the gift. I would now like to invite Kasturi onto stage to say a few words. Hello, everyone. Before I start my thank you speech, I would like to give a gift to Nina Nandi, who was backstage helping me this entire time. So. Okay, so <laughs> thank you everyone for coming and for watching. I have a lot of people to thank, and when I look into the rows, everyone here has contributed in some way into making my dream our engagement reality, and so I thank everyone very, very much. First, I'd like to thank my parents and my sister for organizing this entire event. Um, they only let me, <laughs> yes. They did so much that I only had to focus on dance, and I'm so grateful for that, so thank you, Amanapa. They were constantly on calls, booking, editing, this and that, like you name it, they were doing it day and night, so thank you, Amanapa. And obviously, the director of our show, my sister. <laughs> I'm so grateful to my amazing family who has come here from India to watch me, my Achi, Arani Achi, Kititata, and Kachachi. Thank you very much. 
And I'd also like to thank my family watching from India. Thank you for staying up so late. And for my mama and Atte there who have worked so hard and have put in a lot of time and effort into making this amazing, incredible night happen. Um, also, I'd like to thank um, all my friends who have come to watch me today. You guys can cheer. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and also the people that I considered my family here, Sushi Atte, Rajesh Mama, Shreya and Dia, thank you so, so much. And for all of my parents, friends who, have, who came in during the week and last night and have done so much work, thank you, thank you so much. And also for Neelima and the, the amazing orchestra. And obviously the main person, my guru, Vidya Andy. As she mentioned, the Arangitrum process was very stressful and it was hard for me specifically in the beginning. But thank you for having faith in me <laughs> and for choosing songs that highlight and emphasize my strength points. So thank you so much, Andy, for being more than just a guru and for being one of my best friends. <laughs> And finally, thank you to everyone here who has come to support me. I really, really appreciate it. Thank you. Good evening, everyone. It's a, such an emotional moment for us. And without all of your support and help, you know, this wouldn't be possible. Thank you everyone for coming all the way from various places, you know, out of state and people who are watching remotely also. Thank you for your wonderful support. I have so much of script, but I'm going to do off script. Um, kindly bear with me. Because after watching such a wonderful uh, show, I cannot miss each and every moment what we have gone through so far. I'll start with uh, our guru, uh, Srimadhi Vidya Babu, who has traveled with us almost a decade now. And she was part of our family with all emotional support, what we needed, and what especially Kasuri needed to mentor her, to coach her, to smile along with her. And wherever she needs she a refined mind, be regiment on those, making sure that, you know, she does her best. Thank you. Thank you for everything what you have done. <laughs> when we talk about um, Srimadhi Vidya, we cannot forget um, Mr. Babu, who has coordinated a lot right from the beginning. And when we started this Arangetram from um, eight months back, we told, you know, we have so much hurdles we have to pass through. And Bob adjusted every piece of, you know, whatever the schedule we asked for, whatever we go, hey, Bob, we don't have now. You know, we have to change this. He was very flexible to adjust everything for us and to make this a grand success. Thank you, Bob. Thank you for wonderful support. <laughs> Coming to the orchestra team, start with Subu. And we fondly called Subu. And we meet every week at Temple, but, um, Every time when I see Subhu, I get a positive vibration always. And everyone around Subhu is always you know, having that positive feeling. And uh, besides all the performance, Subhu was coordinating so many other things with all the musicians to make sure that the show makes it to the next level. Thank you, Subhu. And especially uh, for the Varnam piece song selection, really uh, thank you for, for that uh, wonderful piece. Thank you. And next is our vocal, uh, Nivita Chandrasekhar. And when Vidya Babu talked about it, uh, we have to do that innovatively and with various mesmerizing performance. And she took all the challenges. And uh, thank you, Nivita, for all your uh, mesmerizing voices. Thank you so much. I would just would like to add something to Niveta. It was so moving, especially that Ayyamathakadinam, every time I heard the rehearsals, we went through a few rehearsals, and every time she sings, I used to cry. <laughs> we <laughs> were in today. tears. Yeah. We were in thank tears. I'm so pretty much. sure every such one of you. A, such a nice, uh, thank you so much. Yeah. Thank you, Niveta. <laughs> Not to forget that I'm um, Kautik Ayyar. And I'm a little bit of a problem. 
மூர்த்தி சிறுசானாலும் கீர்த்தி பெருசு அப்படின்னு சொல்லிட்டு அவரோட அந்த வயலின் இட் வாஸ் அன்பிலீவபிள் அண்ட் யூ ப்ராட் பேக் டு தட் செகண்ட் செஞ்சுரி தேங்க்யூ தேங்க்யூ ஸோ மச் don't feel you are elder um, you know by kasuri for again you you are still in a college we totally understand <laughs> and uh, having said that let's give one more big round of applause to our wonderful art director team and besides that i um, wanted to thank my mom and uncle and auntie for coming all the way from india and traveling with us for the almost 48 days and helping us in when we go through all the schedule turbulent schedules and they were with us no you focus on this we will take care of the home and they took care of us almost all of us feeding every session and making sure that you know uh, we were surviving thank you thank you for that <clears throat> next is our wonderful volunteers uh, before i start the volunteers Um, I want to say uh, um, one thirukural kaalathinal seitha udavi sirudenanum nyalathin maana peridu abdin valluvar sollirkar almost 30 plus volunteers and various uh, team uh, decoration to dining front desk to backstage oh my god unbelievable effort every one of you i don't know where you are i'm pretty sure you must be serving somewhere and thank you everyone uh, for your excellent support every moment is going to be in our memory for a long time um, but besides that capturing all this um, with their photography and videography um, thank you biju and team for your excellent support and uh, making sure the live stream is available for the remote participant um, almost 30 states uh, of our friends and family are watching the live stream as of now thank you for that effort and besides that we wanted to take a minute to thank our overseas friends who were supported um our friends family members both of our brothers and sisters and um, who is still you know um, watching the live streaming and they supported a lot whatever we asked you know they were able to get it done in a timely manner making sure that you know we are on schedule right from the invitation printing or every nuances what you see is they contributed a lot thank you thank you everyone of you <clears throat> the important piece our beautiful mcs um, my daughter rakini pratanya and shreya rajesh she started in a you know, wonderfully amazing i thank you thank you for your wonderful speeches really appreciate all your efforts kasturi's friends who came on stage and also you know many of you on that audience place also and thank you for spending all your time this evening and encouraging her i'm pretty sure she has gone through a lot of turbulence during her uh, her graduation or her college and besides that with all this arangetram but you were all cheering her making sure that you know she got the energy thank you for everything what you have done and besides that our um uh, uh food management uh, especially with the rewards uh, indian restaurant uh, they have prepared a delicious dinner and you know make sure that you taste it before you go we cannot close the note without mentioning marcel marcel you and your team have done a wonderful job to make this even seamlessly we cannot have a simple thank you and uh, you have done it again and again and you ensured you know whatever the curve ball we thrown you at even last night 12 am yeah, and you took care of it thank you for such a wonderful support <clears throat> finally i wanted to make a one quick um, moment um i have to thank both uh, marcel and um, shrimati vidya babu for this choosing the date this day 20 years back we both got engaged <laughs> knowingly i knowingly you took care of it uh, marcel thank you thank you for that with that i'm going to request uh, shreya rajesh 
uh, to share a few words. And again, everyone talked about it. I have to tell about Shreya. Please come. She is my, I would say, other daughter. <laughs> and we are seeing her right from, you know, her birth. And um, whatever the tough time we have gone through, you know, we always share with Rajesh and Sushila. And they were the backbone. And I'm sitting on the front. They were roaming all over to make sure the event is happening, you know, successfully. It's all the teams, coordinating with all the teams. Thank you, Rajesh. Thank you, Sushi. Rukmini, want to say your one final word? I just wanted to say thank you all for coming today and on this Sunday. And uh, once again, thank you so much. Thank you, everyone, for joining us on this amazing milestone for Kasturi. Dinner will be served in the cafeteria. And on your way out, please sign the guest signing book for, for, for Kasturi and say a few kind words to the camera at the exit for Kasturi to cherish. Kindly make sure to gather all your belongings as the performance theater will be closed. Have a great night. <laughs>